Hi love bugs, it's KP. Thank you so much for stopping by the channel. Thank you for checking out this video. Um, if you are a regular to my channel, you know I'm kind of a no frills kind of girl. I'll get right to the point. Um, if you are new to the channel, thank you for checking out this video. I hope that you like, comment, and definitely subscribe. I would love having you. Um, I have not done a plan with me video in quite a while. And I know that some people found my channel like through some of my earlier planner videos so i definitely want to make sure that i'm still keeping that incorporated into the channel because it's definitely still a part of me um if you follow my instagram you know that i'm still doing my my weekly layouts my monthly spreads the diys the whole nine yards i've just been a bit lazy about actually recording those things so i'm going to try to fix that a little bit <laughs> So, for the month of March and maybe a little bit of April, what I want to do is just kind of have some planner chat videos where we just talk planner stuff. So, the first video I'm going to do is just going to be um, my planner collection, which is not very large at all. I only have a few here. But I also think that's another reason why I wanted to do it because I don't have a huge haul. I mean, a huge collection, excuse me. And that's okay. Um, so... I've always been a paper planner girl, um, but I didn't discover like this world of planners until early 2014. So, and that was when I got my first um, planner. So it was kind of like, wow. And I got a sugar plum planner first, a sugar paper, and then I got an Erin Condren, and then the happy planners came out, and I got a Webster's Pages. And, you know, it's just kind of been growing from there. So, like I said, I've always been a planner girl, I always carried a paper planner, even like the little small. Just kind of calendar books. So, like again, I just want to share kind of the collection. I'll do a couple of these different videos, um, and they'll each have like a different thing to them. So I hope you all enjoy them and continue to come back and watch. So we'll start with my current personal size planner that I carry every day in my purse. This is the black and white white Heidi Swap personal size, and I'm not gonna go through the insides or anything because I think I have set up videos um, on the channel already, but this little sucker is pretty thick in the inside there which is what i like <laughs> um the planner band i made myself with just a hair bow from dollar tree and a flower so inexpensive diy right there which i'm sure most of you already know about but this is one of my personal size planners i love that thing um and i switched those out seasonal kind of now my everyday like serious everyday planner is the happy planner and this is by uh Mambi, me and my big ideas and i love the ring system oh, and i just dropped it that's okay not gonna edit that out <laughs> um but i love this and this is one of the covers that came with the um cover set that they released a couple months ago um the planner band and the little um pin holder are new that just came out with the release of last month so definitely had to get some of that good stuff but this is my baby this is like the holy grail everything is in here like this is my life in here and it kind of has its own little easel <laughs> so that's my babe and then we have my personal collections and i'm sorry y'all my nails are in the process of being done i didn't polish them because i didn't want to wait for them to dry to record this video um this is another heidi swap this is the Gold and white personal size. This is a Webster's Pages. This is the lilac and white, and it is completely gorgeous. Yes, I have not used it at all yet. As you can see, the inserts are still wrapped in plastic. I'll be breaking that puppy out for the springtime. This is my very first Webster's Pages and my personal, very first personal size planner binder style anyway, and this is the gold Webster's Pages. This is the dark pink Webster's Pages. And I last used this at Christmas time, and it was so pretty for the holiday. And as you can see, I still got some of my little holiday um, <laughs> clips and stuff in here. So that's that one. Um, then I have a Carpe Diem planner, which I have a setup video on the channel already for the Carpe Diem. And I'm going to do another one because I did just change some stuff around um, because I am using this planner primarily for the month of March. But I do like this planner a lot. It's my first A5 size planner. Um, so, yeah, I like that a lot. And I actually caught that on sale at Blitzy. So, I don't think I 
paid forty dollars for it maybe then i have some more happy planners of course because i love them this is oh i'm about to have a situation here i need to get some bookends but um <laughs> This in is this one here I use as my home planner, and I just kind of created that with some other covers and the home planner inserts and some additional rings. Like it's so easy to customize those. I just love the happy planner, like it's so easy to do so so much with those. Um, and this here is one of the new 2016 2017 Create 365 Mammy Planners. I uh, love, love, love these. I cannot wait to break that bad boy out. I will definitely start using that when they start in July, I believe, is when the new one starts. So I'll start using that one. And I'm probably going to get one more of the new ones because there is another style that I want also. I knew this was going to give me trouble today they've set up here good like for two weeks and now this new today it's gonna be a problem but anyway then i have a final facts personal domino i just got this like literally it is still completely wrapped up look at that i just got this from amazon maybe last week or two weeks ago so i haven't even broke it out yet but i've been wanting to follow facts so this is my first one of those um we'll see i love the color it kind of it's a little, definitely more pink than the Webster's Pages one. Um, and I'm going to break that out probably the summer. I don't know yet. Then I have this beautiful Heidi Swap memory planner. Oh my gosh, it's so gorgeous. I bought it as a kit from Michaels. I mean, because it's gorgeous, right? But I have not used it. And it is now March. So, yeah. So I don't really know what I'm going to do with this at this point. <laughs> it was definitely an impulse buy. It was not something I needed, but I just had to have it. So you have to be careful doing things like that because then you don't use them. And they literally just sit on your shelf, which is not a good thing. You should use your things. All right, guys. So that is just a look again at my little up and growing planner collection. Um, I definitely plan to add more to the collection. Um, like I said, I definitely another happy planner. Um, there's a few other things I have in mind that I definitely want, <laughs> but you know, one step at a time, I'm not going broke buying planners for sure. All right. So I hope you all enjoyed that. Like I said, it was just a little glimpse at the planner collection. Um, I'll be back later on either this week or next week with another planner related video. I hope you all enjoyed um, and I'll talk to you real soon. Bye.